Hi, this is Shane, and welcome back to another episode of Antimatter Chemistry. And in the last episode, we we made stuff. What did we make? We made antimatter, coloured antimatter. Uh, we made aluminium oxide, magnesium oxide and potassium chloride and that was to make 10 obsidian and I did go ahead and turn the obsidian into a nether portal so we will go in in a second I also went mining I've taken all this out not there I went and mine loads I think and I also broke down a lot of stuff as well and I put it away so I did that and if I show you my little mining pit, it is, you know, loads of it's gone because that's all I was doing. I was just mining. So there's that. So this week, what are we going to do? This week, well, we, we're going to go into the nether, which I did just to see what's there. But I didn't... Did I take the reward? I don't think I took the reward. But we will look at seeing if we can get any of these three done. It depends on how hard it is. But let's go into the nether together. Hold on. Because after you make that, you had set home. And to do that, it tells you, you forward slash set home command. So now if you wander off, I think you can type, if you, let me see, if I go over here and then type forward slash home, yeah, it brings me back here. So actually we need to mark home with a different colored block because knowing me, I'll forget and then I'll teleport back home actually it's here I'll teleport back home and end up suffocating because I've moved something so let's put these here so at least I'll remember that's home and then let's go into the nether And I moved the nether portal away a little bit because, you know, the noise and stuff. Really annoying. But I literally just stepped into the portal, had a look around, and back out again. I didn't do anything. But I do remember the nether has... Oh, is that a ghast? It sounds like a ghast. It has... Oh, there's an enderman. I can hear a ghast. So the nether has mobs in it. Portal. Let's have a quick venture out. Yeah, I'm not interested. And I think I did bring, I brought back some nether rack just to see what it would break down into. Okay, let us take, let's put this here, stand on it. And then let's check. No. Right, so I put the block there and stood on it just in case it vein mines the blocks under me because, you know, didn't want to fall into a hole or into lava. So we'll bring him back. Oh, is that busted? Okay, that's fine. Oh, you know what I haven't done? I haven't set it to show me the mobs. 
on on journey map so if i press j options um mini map preset one and mob display change that to large icons close and that will show me what what mobs there are on the map because it's something i would do in the overworld as well but seeing that there are no mobs in the overworld i hadn't done it yet and let's see actually let's put this in here we have to look at getting some form of power because the power situation is dire. I found that the culinary generator was better than the pink generator. So I've switched back to the culinary generator. Come on. I just need enough to make a couple of loaves of bread. Are there watering cans in this? I should check and see. Um, I've got enough for a loaf of bread. And a beetroot. Uh, what are we looking for? Watering can. Oh, there are watering cans in this. There is. Uh, we need stone and a bowl. Did we make a watering can already? No. Somebody, oh, I believe somebody gave me a tip for crafting stone. But I believe it was Michael. Um, smelting kiln. Chemical combiner. Oh, silicon dioxide will give you stone. That's right. Michael did tell me that. Uh, silicon dioxide. Oh, we can get gold from... Oh. We can get gold from netherrack. Okay, that's interesting. And then silicon dioxide gives us stone. So we want five. Uh, unlock recipe. Nope, that's not what we wanted. Lock that recipe. Let's try again. So silicon dioxide can give you stone or cobblestone. Depending on what recipe you lock in. Well, that's interesting. Um, e. Press it, press A, and that's bookmarked it. So let's make a um, oh, we need to make a bowl. Uh, in a V shape, that gives us a bowl. Put the bowl in the middle. Is it that? Yep. That would give us the watering can. The watering can we can fill up in our infinite water source. And then we don't have to worry about shifting next to our crops anymore. Because now the watering can should do it. it I think the watering can works in a 9x9 nine nine square. So if we stand here in the middle, I should get everything. It doesn't seem to be getting that one in the corner though. Maybe it only works in a 4x4 four four then. Or 
maybe we should have gone in. I don't know. But anyhow, it's working faster than pressing shift. Right, bit more. Bit more. Are you empty? Okay. Well, that wasn't too bad. Take you out. Make another loaf of bread. Yeah, we need to work on the power. Right, so we have set home. We have gone to hell. Did I? I must have picked the reward. Choice reward was 4K ME storage cell or 4K storage disk. Did I pick? I must have picked the reward. Oh, pick one. Okay. Um, I'm not doing any storage. Okay, so I've picked. Didn't I pick? Choice reward. Storage disk. No. Maybe I did choose it. I don't know. Okay, green antimatter. Ru Rubidium can be acquired from loot crates from killing mobs. At this stage, you can find mobs in the nether. Oh, they had to send us into the nether to fight. I didn't really want to. What else can we do? String. There are several sulfurous, sulfurous items in the nether. Break them down and use them to create protein and then string. Nitrogen can be acquired from mushrooms. So two protein. So protein is what? Protein, no. Protein. Uh, fishy matter? Oh, from that quest. Spider eye would give us protein and beta carotene, I guess, because it's a spider. Um, dissolver. Cobwebs. Blue linen. Wool gives us protein. Carpet. String, obviously. Condensed milk. Well, we haven't gotten that far. Mobs. Rotten flesh. Eggs. Was that? Uh, slime blocks. Okay, it's not well, mushroom then. What do they say about mushrooms? Nitrogen can be can be acquired from mushrooms. So let's go back and get some mushrooms then. Do I have nowhere to put magnesium? Uh, no, I don't. Oh. And that's what silicon dioxide. What's that? Oh, we have a full stack already. Okay, let's go collect some mushrooms. What other mobs are there? There's only pigmen and a ghast. The ghast is that way. Okay, yeah, you've gone. Good, good. Or have you come back? Alright, 
Okay, so if I put uh, the mushrooms in there, what do we get? Oh, God. Oh, that's PC, PC, PCP? PCP, yeah. That's a hallucinogen. Oh, we got sulfur. I don't know if we've got anything for those mushrooms. I didn't think to check if there was anything in there. That was a bit of a bust. PC, PCP, yeah. I think that's what it is. That's a hallucinogen. Um, protein. We don't have any protein, though. Uh, combiner. Oh, maybe... Do we have any? Okay. In the chemical combiner, you can use nitrogen. No, that's not what I want. Nitrogen. Now those are uses. I want to find out what makes nitrogen. You say you can get it from... Okay, and what was the other thing? It's either go to hell or a lava bucket. How on earth are we going to make a lava bucket? And is that going to be any easier than going to going to the nether? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I'm... I'm a doofus sometimes. Okay, we have the nether. We can make our way down and make a lava bucket. Do we not have gold? Hydrogen. Is our nitrogen full? Yes. We're going to have to make, um upgrade soon and let's put away our PCP okay let's see if how much iron do we have 49 not much we need to make some kind of armor we can make leather chain Feet of Ra. That sounds Halo of Ra. Okay, it sounds very splendiferous, but we can't make it. Alright, we are going to have to go in with. Oh, can we make wooden armor? We can. But we need, um, we need construct, uh, Tinker's, was it Tinker's Armory? Constructs Armory. What's that? Because I have no idea. Is there a manual for that? We need an armor forge. We need to make way more iron than we have. Is basically what it is. Because from this we can make maybe two ingots. How much? We have six. Because we need 16. We can make two ingots out of this. So if we make two ingots, that will give us eight. Maybe we can make a chest plate or something. Unlock. We want that recipe. And that gives us two. Well, that's better than nothing. Uh, 
And we have an iron chest plate. Um, sword. Might as well make a stone sword. Cobble. Because we don't have any iron to make an iron sword. <laughs> oh boy, this is pathetic. No, we just need one stick. And that. Should have made a tinker sword, but you know what? Oh, uh, we're going, and we might, we will probably need. No. Let's sharpen our pickaxe. And let's go and do something foolish. There's a ghast on this side. Alright, we have marked our portal. I wish I knew where that ghast was though. Wait a minute, we don't need to go down there. We don't need to go down there. There was that hole that I dug and there was lava in the bottom. So yeah, that could work. Ha! See? We have a lava bucket. We didn't need to go around that stupid ghast and get blasted. Right. Uh, lava bucket. And we need it to make a cobblestone gen. Okay. Cobblestone generator. Requires one lava bucket and 16 tellurium. So we need the green antimatter. So we need to go and kill mobs. How do you make a cobble gen in this though? Just wondering. Oh, we need selenium. They... No, that's the first tier. Oh, really? What? Double com... Double compressed cobblestone. So that's five sets of 81 blocks of cobblestone plus tellurium ingot which we haven't come across yet but we get it from killing mobs in the nether I think. So we have to, no, we have to make green antimatter. So we have to go and kill mobs. I'm guessing. Green anti. Rubidium. Which you get from. You get from killing monsters. Okay, so we're going to have to go back into the nether and kill, kill something. See, if we kill, um, zombie, zombie pigmen, then we'll get swarmed by zombie pigmen. What else is there? Oh, this is, it's not very frightening at all, is it? No. What other mobs? Unless I. Hmm. The only mobs they have in here are zombie pigmen. Does that mean I have to turn around and anger the zombie pigmen? Oh, that's from, that must have been from the, 
the same. Okay. Um, I don't know where to go. I'm quite high up. It's not that many mobs though. That is the thing. It's not even as if all it's teeming with with life. It's not. We could aggro the um, the pigment. If we do that, I have no idea what will happen. If I die, it's nice knowing you guys. Here they come. up everything right we got everything that wasn't too bad I hope well I have beet root I can make soup I oh, know how many beet roots do you need to make soup I don't usually make soup, so I have no idea. Uh, you need six, and we have five. Okay, one more. Did it? No. No, I meant to eat it. Oh, really? Are you... Am I healing? No, because my... Oh, very slowly. Okay. Right, let's open these loot crates and see what's in them. Okay, rubinium, only one. So in these loot crates, you just get I've just got one rubinium and I need to make a whole stack. Cassia, oh we've got some caffeine, sulfur, zinc, carbon, rotten flesh. When we break that down, let's see if there's anything in there. No. Right, so if we put in rotten flesh, we just, oh we get protein. And sulfur, Oh, and that gives you sulfur. Duh. Gold nuggets. Can we get anything from that? Just gold. Okay. Well, that was a bit of an anticlimax, maybe? Because, yeah, we have one rubinium, and to make green antimatter green green anti that gives us eight so we need eight eight rubinium to make a stack so I need to go and do that again 
But before I do that, I need to stock up on some more food. Okay. Plant back some trees. Oh, I didn't make upgrades. And I made the template, but why didn't I make... I can't remember why I didn't make the upgrade. Okay, so... We have protein. Which bit needed protein? String. So how do you make string? How many string did we need? I didn't actually look. Uh, two protein and four strain. Um, chemical combiner, two protein. Okay, so... Two protein gives us four strain. So at least we got that. Uh, two protein, four strain, right? Two protein, four strain. No, that didn't complete. Two protein, four string. I'm not being... Is it because we didn't get this? Okay, we did that. I suspect it's because it thinks we haven't picked the reward. But I haven't picked it. It won't. It, I don't know. I think it thinks that we haven't done this. Although we have done it. We haven't claimed the reward. Okay. Oh, okay. I see what I, I didn't do that. All right. Fine. So then we can do go to hell. Storage disk. Right. Then we can do strain. Oh, finally. Okay. A hang glider. From string you got a hang glider. Fishing rod. I think the fishing rod might be useful. Please tell me that that's the normal fishing rod. Yes. Three sticks and two string. Because I don't want to deal with the nether right now. Um, right, so we've done that. And we get cactus juice and fishy matter. Okay, well then let's do a spot of fishing before the end of the episode. Or I should say, to end the episode on. Hopefully there's no hidden nasties there. And it's the same as vanilla fishing. But, um, yeah, so it's time for the end of the episode. So while we're relaxing fishing, thanks for watching. Um, please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel. And I really like reading the comments that you guys give me because you give me some pretty brilliant stuff. What was that? Oh, an enchanted... Oh, nice. Enchanted bow. Can't make any arrows, but there you go. But yes, please like, comment and subscribe. I love reading your comments. And it really helps to grow my channel. And I will see you in the next episode. 
okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.